So, oh, isn't, aren't these nice? These have just started blooming. I was going to take this plant out until I saw the blooms. They're pretty awesome camellias. This is a camellia too, by the way. This is a, where'd it go? Camellia sinensis. This is tea. This is what tea grows from, and I'm going to, I'm not sure where I'm going to put that yet. So we'll go into the porch here, and I'll show you around the inside a little bit. This is my nice screened-in porch. Um, <laughs> I built that arbor that's out there. I do some Halloween, some orange lights around it. So this is my little porch to sit out in. I was going to take these sticks and this and make a, a like a, a besom decoration for Halloween, but I haven't done it yet. This my Halloween. Yeah, and I've got some aloe here. Okay, so let's go inside. So this is my house. You were out front. That's the front door there. And when I came, this was all kind of a drab, light blue in here, so I wanted it red. <laughs> so anyway, so this is the living room. I got some Halloween stuff there. I like seeing people's houses, so, you know, I don't care whether they're big or small, apartment, you know, mansion. I just love seeing houses, so that's why I share mine. And mine has all been furnished with, like, mostly secondhand stuff that was not very expensive at all because I didn't bring a lot with me from California. A lot of the artwork though on the walls, the artwork, um, the photography is, is mine. I have different pinhole and Holga and those are pinholes there. That was my aunt did that. And these are my sort of my ancestry. I haven't set up an ancestor altar yet, um, but these are my um, my grandmother. These are, this is my artwork and I was holding masks of my grandmother's faces over my own face and those are cyanotypes. Um, I love to cook. I love to work with food. I love to do fermentation. Um, so my, my kitchen's pretty good. I, I built the, the um, butcher block there and that was a fun and exciting thing to do and I've got my spices back there. Oh, I also like mixologies. <laughs> booze. I like the flavors, you know? I like the flavors. Um, and upstairs is, have, there's a couple, there's bedrooms. There's three bedrooms, but one of them, I'll show you the one that is my uh, meditation room. And um, so this is my meditation room. I uh, mostly sit there. They have a green Tara and medicine Buddha and my Russian tarot. And I've got, there's a lot of, this is kind of a lot of Asian themes since I, I practiced Aikido for about 13 years. Um, that was my sensei as he's passed on, so I inherited that. Um, so I've got a lot of my, my Zen in Aikido books in here. It's my bedroom in there and there's a there's a guest room in there. So now I'll take you downstairs to where I spend a lot of time doing some work and talk a little bit about more about myself. These are more um, these are more of my pinholes. I have a series of pinhole self-portraiture that are a little well they're different. I like them. So um, that's that. So this is my this is my office slash studio slash creative space. I do a lot of photographic work, and I've got a lot of my herb herbal and witchy kind of books up there. It's more of my artwork there. Um, my daughter's artwork. She did that in high school, and I have a bulletin board for putting prints up just to look at prints that I've made and my sewing machine. I'm getting a wood stove because the fireplace is just too smoky, so in another month I'll have a nice little wood stove that sits right there. There's my skelly friend. There's my Baba Yaga that um, Jackie painted for me. Commissioned her to do that. That's another one of my pieces of artwork. Um, and those are all my pieces of... Um, those are gelatin silver prints. I still do traditional darkroom photography. And here I have some of my resins and incense, some of my like Russian and Eastern European folk magic kind of books. And I have a um, Saraswati 
since she is the goddess of learning and art, and I am an artist, and I've got a couple different tarots here. This was my senseis too. And some crystals, my crystals, and I set this up because it felt right to me. I mean, those of you who know more about stuff know more, but oh, my tooth keeps falling. This is this is a wisdom tooth I had out uh, not that long ago, just a few months ago. And there's a little um, crow fetish because I am quite fond of crows. That's my father in that little picture from when he worked at the steel mill. Um, there's a Russian, I mean not a Russian, a Polish kugat rooster and a Polish egg. I've got some calcite back there and I'll sit down a little bit and talk with you now.